Welcome back, everybody. Hey, yo. So, our friend, the Garuda woman, who is going to buy our ore, should be doing that now, buying our ore. Oh, yeah. Hopefully, she wants the one we have. Holy hotness. <laughs> Daytime sure is scorching here. Hey, Ace, you have some amber. Is that the one? Amber, yeah, that's the thing we have ten of. Oh, Lord. That's the one thing we have ten of, I think. <laughs> Dang, we shouldn't have sold those ten other ones. <laughs> That's okay. So we still got 500 instead of 300 rupees. We like tripled our current. <laughs> that's true. Yeah, that's real nice. Nice. All right. Do we have? Did we get 10 more on the way up to the uh, guy? Probably not. But mm. we have 10 opal. Once we've, she's buying that. If we need, if we had three more amber. Mm. Um. Okay, I bet I can find three more amber real quick, but. Maybe we'll just come back here next time we need to... We'll just have collected more, in general. Yeah. It's so frustrating. In my file, she only asks me for diamonds, which I only have three of, and it's like, ugh. <laughs> like, she only ever asks about diamonds. And I'm like, no, I don't have ten diamonds. <laughs> uh, I think I do. I, I don't sell to anybody else anymore. I just hoard until she's lying. Yeah. I but, gave I gave up, because she literally only wants diamonds for me. I'm like, oh, hey. You gotta get more diamonds. Hey, just go beetle. around the coast. Yeah. The, the, Is that where they are? Well, they could be anywhere, but I find there's a lot of golden ones along the eastern coast where there's, like, nothing else. Like, along sheer cliff side, sometimes you'll find the golden uh, thing. Mm. Like, around the Tingle Island area. Yeah, maybe we'll check that out. Down here. Yeah. Okay, so I'm actually going to glide down to the next tower. Or towards the next tower. Nice. It should be that orange one right there. Ooh. Wait. Not ready yet. I changed my mind. I want to mark that uh, shrine <laughs> on my map. Because I'm not going immediately to that shrine, but I would like to mark it. Yeah, it's good to mark it, for sure. And that is another stable shrine, I believe. Yeah, the stable's right to the left of it here. Whoop. Alright, so I'm going to get the tower. That's probably all I'm going to do in this episode, but if we have more time, then I'll get, we'll get that shrine and this one right here. Nice. Sounds like a good uh, episode to me. I'm gonna jump down from this now, I think. Oh, we're not gonna have the stamina to do this, I'm realizing now. This is normally how I get there, but I Yeah, we're not gonna make it all the way there. <laughs> Actually, we might make it to the shrine. <laughs> That'd be fine. It's shrine time. It is shrine time. And then I'm gonna do that. That's my favorite tower in the game. That is a cool one. God, yes, because going up it, I got knocked off and fell down it, hitting along it, taking damage the entire time. <laughs> Died, Meef was great, uh, uh, revived me, and then I kept rolling down the mountain, taking damage until I landed <laughs> with like a quarter heart left. Nice. It was like, it was such an ordeal to get up to the top of that tower. And then even then, it's hard to get to the tower because it's like covered in the gunk. I couldn't figure out how to get up until I, I finally figured it out for myself, and I was just very happy about it. <laughs> That's cool. That's cool how, like, you know, memories of your first impressions of the game, like, affect, uh, you know, how much you might like something later on. Oh, totally. Yeah. And I, I mean, that in a way, that's nostalgia, but I think that's the case with a lot of games. Like, yeah. everybody plays... We mentioned this in our podcast after E3, but that was a little while ago now, but, like, everybody played through games differently, even if it's the same game, and your own unique experiences with the game are gonna shape how you think of it. Yeah. More so than anybody else, anything else will. do this trial. Oh, here you go. Sorry. Oh, right. Yeah. Yeah, it's a shrine. That's a thing. Cool. Uh, alright. Oh. I oh, oh, yeah, that's right. Oh, good, good. Stop it. Tilt it back and then pause it. B yeah. to cancel. B. Nice. Wow, that was easy. I bet there's a treasure chest on the underside, but we did it. <laughs> I, like, did it before I realized what we were supposed to do well to solve it. <laughs> alright. Bam. Ooh, maybe don't use the guardian sword too, that it's running out. Uh, it's almost broken. Um, the torch. The torch. <laughs> Yo, we're gonna need you quicker. Let's shoot an arrow at it. Agreed. Uh, A not ice arrow. Yeah. <laughs> Good shot. Boop. Uh, yeah, that chest up there is kind of tough. Can we magnesis it? Where is it? Link is facing. Oh. No. Um, how do you get that one? A thing rotates around this part when you, uh, hit the switch with an arrow. Oh, okay. Oh, jump. Oh, jump, jump, jump. Oh, no. Yeah, that's what I remember happening a lot. Yeah, it's tough. 
Yes. We might have to pass on this. Especially with two people playing the game. <laughs> yeah, it's true. <laughs> okay. We are a couple of idiots. Well, at least we know how to get it. Yes. We can always come back to it. I'll consider that one gotten. <laughs> yeah. Um. No. Oh, what's this deal? Another rotato. Rotato potato. Oh, this one took me forever. Oh, really? Okay, I think we could get it not too hard. It's probably not that oh, hard. Oh, wait, no, don't return it back yet. Oh, no. It's close. Okay, so you are the only one in control of this. Exactly. No, oh, shoot. Okay. That's yeah. okay, you can do it. Oh. Oh. Yeah. 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 That took me, like, one one-hundredth the time it took me the first time I did it. <laughs> Sweet. That is good, because we're doing a show. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Performing under pressure. Do-do-do. Somebody! <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Don't you start, mister. I would. <laughs> hey, we can upgrade our, our schnaz. Yeah, we can upgrade the schnaz. I'll be taking my controller back. There you go. Thank you. Thanks for sharing the joy. Dude, anytime. Alright, time for Notorio. It's been a while since we saw our butts. Spec our butts. Butt. I almost said our butts. It's been a while since we saw our horses. <laughs> it's I mean, been a long time since we've shown our butts here on Sky Jam. Yeah. God, episode one was a long time ago. Yeah, everybody go find it. <laughs> There's like one episode of Sky Jam somewhere within it is one frame of just a butt. Well, episode one of Sky Gem does involve uh, prostate prostate exam. It joke. does. That's right. That so. was that that fun prostate exam joke. Yeah. Oh, I love that. Unforgettable. That's right. <laughs> really, we peaked pretty early, I think. Yeah. Yeah. We should perform more <laughs> prostate exams on the show. Yeah. No, it's it's definitely a, a, a good thing to do. Or any. We we have not yet. It wasn't an actual prostate exam. Let me rephrase that. Oh, see, I remember it differently. That's true. Although I think we stopped recording before. Uh, Dr. Captain Toad really got in there. Yeah. That's oh, good thing, too. That yeah, was, it was messy. It was nasty. He's not a licensed doctor. No, not at all. He's barely a licensed captain. <laughs> anyway, here we are. <laughs> Poor Toad. Let's go, you filth. Oh, head. It's a battle. Oh, I have the thing. Torch. Oh, wait a minute. I also have the wrong armor on. We can actually wear good armor now. Yeah. Like, good healing, like, not dying armor. Not dying armor. These are still the best pants and best hat. Okay, that's the only difference. <laughs> uh, let me change my weapon. Do we something. do have Daruk's protection now, so that, that is also helpful. Oh, okay. <laughs> I have a fun idea. Oh, no. Got, oh, maybe. Maybe. Oh. Oh. So I think I can close. just use literally any weapon to do this, though. Yeah, probably. Hold on. Oh, maybe not. Maybe just weapons heavier than that. <laughs> there you That's go. That's the way to go. <laughs> there you go. He's like, not the torch! Oh, is it still alive? Oh, what? No, I nah. must have got it like right before he died. Yeah, see, he's not. It took all I had just to stay alive against that monster, but you beat it like it was a straw training dummy. Whoever you are, you deserve this more than I do. Yay! Energy that line should be very helpful. Yeah. I came out this way in search of the c citadel. Can't believe I made it so close, only to have to turn back now. Aha! <laughs> That's the Akala Castle ruins! Long ago, at the peak of Hyrule's power, they built a fortress to protect Akala. It was said to be unassailable, but during the Great Calamity, Hyrule Castle fell. The army had no royalty to lead them. This guy's got a very triumphant voice. He looked like like a King Arthur guy with yeah. the blow, flowing blonde hair. Yeah, I gotcha. With no other choice, they fell back to the Citadel to make their last stand. Sadly, a concentrated assault from the out-of-control guardian spelled the end for this fortress, too. I love this fortress's just design and... Oh, it so does good. look really cool. In a real sense, the kingdom of Hyrule met its doom here. 
I found out my own kitten died in that battle, so I came at to at least pray at the spot where they fell. But it turns out the old guardians are still active, so this is as far as I go. I've never heard of anyone else escaping a guardian sights, at least. You don't look reckless enough to chance it, but be on your guard in these hills all the same. Right, time to chance it. There is a Korok down there, but... Hmm. But we're gonna instead go across to this. Oh, we could just walk around. Ride, Notorio! There's a path, <laughs> a ridge! We could take, instead of this bridge... Away! Is, really it is the guardian legs in the way. Oh, I see. There you go. I thought he was just misbehaving. <laughs> that wouldn't be that surprising. Horses are very hard to <laughs> have go where you want in this game, unless you tame them. Yeah, you gotta, gotta get that good horse taming tech. All right, and as far as we go, do. Do we not have a bow? Oh, we don't have a bow. Yeah. Oh. No. He poked it back. This is bow isn't even use worth using. <laughs> whoa, whoa. There Ice. we go. Took me long enough. Yeah. Poking you with your own weapon. That's right. What do you feel about that? All right. It's time to g g go. It is. All right. I like how the moblins are also afraid of it. Yeah, this one's really well guarded. It is. That's because it's, I mean, the ancient tech labs here. Yeah, true. Alright, cool, cool. And also, uh, Keat, uh, what's his name? Kilton is here. There's a lot in this area, actually. Oh, yeah. Kilton. Once you to sell him his monster parts. Kilton. Oh my god, that's a great voice for him once you Ah, <laughs> yes. He, he is around here? He's at Skull Lake, which is way... He's, uh... Oh, right. Right? You first meet him here, at Skull Lake. Yeah, you're right. I'm being targeted. Yes. Uh, Zurich's protection? <laughs> that was... <laughs> that was the camera. <laughs> Oops. This is par for the course. Nice. If I could get to a good place where I could look at it, I could reflect these. Nice. Oh, he's got so much health, it does. Alright, I'm out of here. <laughs> I'm out. Yeah, cool. Oh, that's right. I love it. And this is gonna help us throughout this. Yeah. Oh, show. It's smart, because the way I did it, I used it twice near the very beginning here, then not again, and then eventually I realized I could use it for the very end, and I was so proud of myself for figuring that out. <laughs> So I tried a lot of different ways of getting on this tab. Like, I tried many different catapult-esque ways of getting up here. Yeah, everyone I know who's played this game and has done this tower, like, I feel like everyone had a hard time with this one. Yeah, it's definitely meant... I think it's the hardest tower. It might be. Which is good that we're doing it now. Yeah. Also, the one near, um... I forget which one it is, but there's, like, water and Liz Alphos all around it, and they shoot electric arrows. Oh, yeah, yeah, the, the Korok one. We're good. That's probably the next one we're doing, honestly. Yeah, that one's pretty rough. That is... I like them. I like these puzzly towers. I really feel like I mentioned even getting up it. Oh, geez, that was yeah. close. Now I should be able to grab it. Oh, nice. That's what it's all about. I must have, like, tried this one and then, like, gave up and then came back when I had more stamina. Oh, yeah, stamina might be an issue, actually. Good thing that guy gave us a stamina thing. Well, let's, let's see. Let's see what's going on. It's so obvious now, but it took me a while to figure this out the first time. Like, the, the better part of an hour. <laughs> that might be good, yeah. Yeah. This skunk is so gross looking. It, it also looks delicious at the same is. time. It's like grape. It's, it's grape jelly if it went really bad. Oh. Like, if the expiration date on it was from, like, the 90s. Ooh. That's what jam would look like. Hey, speaking of jam, jam, do you mind closing that orange door over there? I can do that. Thank you. That'll make that 
that awful noise go away. It's making a lot of noise, that noisy, noisy door. Oh, man, what a noisy door. <laughs> I'm back. The door is a very vibrant orange color. It is. I like it. Thank you. It's a good door. I appreciate that. I'm a fan of door. Uh, nobody knows what we're talking about because this is generally an audio medium for our... Oh, no, yeah, they could just hear us describe this orange door. Oh, it's such a good door. It's very orange. Very good. Then we'll mark it, and then we'll end the episode. Cool. Oh, here it is. My favorite tower. It's beautiful. Yeah. Rolling planes remain, remind me so much of Shadow of the Colossus. Like everything in this game. <laughs> but I love it for that reason as well. Really makes me wait for it. Land! Land ho! <laughs> oh man, the labyrinth's up there too. Yeah, I That's love that labyrinth. It's a lot. Oh, right. Uh, let me mark this up real quick. So you tell me if you know anything. Oh, so when I fell down, I then climbed back up this way, came around here, fought a Hinox, <laughs> uh, and then came like up through here. Wow. Uh, but let's see here. So we got Shrine. We got Fairy Fountain, which we'll mark with a star. Sure. There's a Shrine here. I want to say it's in this rock. I don't remember exactly where. There's probably a shrine on Tingle Island, right? There is. Yeah. I Yes, I remember it now. It's somewhere on there. Mm -hmm. I don't remember the exact spot, but... There's one there, but we got to start that one here. There's like a Korok thing there. Yeah, right. We got the stable. We got this one. We got the Eye of Skull Lake. There's a lot. Wow. Yeah. Uh, we got the maze. Yeah, wow. I don't know if there's any in the Tumulia Highlands. Because there's Robbie's house, but that's not a shrine. Right. I think there's one near-ish Robbie's house. It might be the one you already have marked there, but... Maybe, yeah. Yeah. I think so. And I, there's probably one around here, but I don't... I don't think I've found one in these forests yet. Myself. It's probably good for now, at least. And then we could use this lake as a shortcut back to Zora's Domain. Yeah. That's yeah. right. Cool. Next time on Skyjam. Yeah. Uh, who knows what'll happen? I don't. I don't either, man. Probably a bunch of shrines and us increasing our hearts and stamina, but yeah. it's up to James. Maybe we'll go for the Quarks, maybe we'll just head towards Hebra. Find out next time.